Welcome back, Anderson. Seems like a nice town so far. Burgess aside. Pretty woods. Cute lodge we got set up in. We should go for a hike if we get a chance. Now you're just being mean, Anderson. PDs <laughs> aren't exactly up to the task, but hopefully the sheriff will be more helpful. Not a surprise about the deputies. Doubt they see much stuff this gruesome. Is that another lunchbox up there or what? Yeah. What's going on There's with another lunchbox? Have a corrode day. I said, I, th this. Can't fit the clues all together yet. Heart removed, tripod, tracks leading to a dead end. A tripod for a camera? To record a, a snuff film? Maybe. And why take out his heart just to throw it away? The stuff ends. Probably. More than likely. We just shortcut. Oh, we shortcut it this way. All right, let's go. We, that's probably blocks. Yeah. Woo! Oh my God! This so far everything's been just insane. Here we are. Let's drive back to town and meet the sheriff at the diner. All right. Let's get out of here. Bright Falls, it is, baby. Let's go. I am heavily invested now. I am I am heavily invested now. 100%. I can't get that manuscript page out of my head. I've never seen killers reach out so directly before. Damn impressive work so far. With your technique, these hunches. Hunches, yeah. Fast. I wasn't sure about taking a case so far from home, but I'm thrilled to be here for this mystery. That's a good way to see it, you know, but still, like, oh my God, this looks. Need to swing by the lodge to get anything from the field office. No, I'm all set. I'll park there anyway. I want to walk to the diner, get a feel for the town. I. This is absolutely amazing. It's just beautiful. Oh the my! The is just up the waterfront. Shouldn't keep the sheriff and our witnesses waiting. I smell coffee. Oh, Bright Falls. We haven't discovered. How much coffee have you had today, Charlie? There we go. Don't know. Don't care. <laughs> How much have you had? Not enough. That's all. Right. Okay. To toot my own horn, but I am pretty darn sure my oh dear. I mean our float. You will be the bell of the ball at this year's deer fest. Deer fest. Oh, here's a diner. Let me guess. The FBI. Welcome to Bright Falls. It's nice to have you here. I got you both some coffee. Oh, it's Washington's finest. Nice to meet you, Sheriff. I'm set for coffee. You know, I wouldn't say no to another. I'm Agent Saga Anderson. This is Agent Alex Casey. Tim Brinker. And let me just say, I'm happy you two are here. Frankly, we could use the help. Your deputy said you had a couple of witnesses here. The they sheriff. They sound like suspects. Mulligan and Thornton are still on about that? No, no. The bookers don't strike me as the murdering type, but you can decide for yourselves. They're just inside having coffee and pie to calm their nerves. I'll see what they have to say. Oh, this Casey, is interesting. You notes with the sheriff. Take your time. He, I see, he's from a bunch of other games that they made. These files you sent over, Sheriff. Have you had many people besides your known... Oh, here we go, here we go, here we go. Sure. Are you the book? Excuse me. I'm Agent Saga Anderson. Are you the bookers? That's us. I'm Tammy, and he's Ed. Hello, officer. Just Saga is fine, Ed. So, are we being charged with anything? Because if not, we'd love to get back to our hotel and decompress after what we saw. Take a bath. Scream into pillows, that kind of thing. We're not charging you. I just have a few questions. Nothing to stress about. 
Okay. All right. Why were you at Cauldron Lake? What were you doing at Cauldron Lake last night? I'm a writer. True crime. We're here from New York, doing some research on a famous novelist, Alan Wake, who went missing here. I was down at the lake, getting some details. Perfectly legal. So what did you see in the woods? This naked dude came out of the lake, and he was acting crazy, shouting weird shit at us. He must have been on something. Unless skinny dipping at dawn is a thing around here. Then we heard shooting. We ran into these psychos in deer masks. They were tearing into the naked guy with knives, like some kind of satanic cult. <laughs> I love, oh my god. This is so. We bolted and called the cops. What? what makes you say it was a cult? <laughs> the masks and knives aren't enough. They were shouting, cult of the tree. The cult of the tree. Cult of the tree. Oh, and then we found out. The whole thing was... Oh, something's there. They're not, they're not telling the whole truth. All right, the Booker's Cult of the, the Tree. Cult of the Tree. What are the Bookers telling me? I found their necklace. The symbol is two triangles. The cult wants their spruce tree back, Tammy. Finder's keeper is Ed. My publisher will want this on the cover. Tammy found something. A necklace belonging to one of the cultists. All right, and then Cauldron Lake itself. The Bookers were at Cauldron Lake. Why? was built to hide what's there. They say the writer fell in the lake. Private party. No trespassing. My book has questions. Pass the bolt cutters. They broke in for the sake of Tammy's book. Nothing to do with a the murder. They were telling the truth. Okay. The victim was one of their own. FBI Special Agent Robert Nightingale gone missing here 13 years ago. Okay. That way it suddenly turned up, only to be murdered in a brutal ritual on the very day of their arrival. Look at that. And then there was the page. This page, the first page that they had found, not the last, the first step down into terrifying depths, secret truths trembling beyond the threshold. Reading the words, I these words felt like a message. I love this. It was a message. I love this so much. Someone knew they were here. What they were doing. Someone playing a game with them. Leading them on. An invitation. How could they not accept? The sheer audacity of this impossible mystery presented to them. Even if they knew it would end up hurting them. So you found something there, right? A necklace these cultists may have dropped. Okay. Wow. How did you put that together? It's evidence. You need to hand it over. Okay. Told you not to keep that key with me. Thanks. This could prove to be helpful. Is that the same? Stick around. Is that? Well, her name was Rose? Like reading it in a dream of missing you. Oh, God. Saga! Saga Anderson. As I live and breathe. I thought we'd never see you back here after that awful, awful thing happened to your baby girl. And that is Rose. Um, I'm sorry. Who are you? I don't know what you're talking about. It's me, silly. Rose. You know me. I don't think I do. And what horrible thing happened to my baby girl? She drowned. Your daughter. That's so weird you don't remember. How do you know I have a daughter? Oh, I know what this is. 
You're blocking out your traumatic memories. Happens on TV all the time. No. I I never like Ro Rose did the same thing to Alan. Taking me for someone else. If you say so. Bro, that's a trip. That is a trip. How Seen anything out of the ordinary in town lately? Suspicious people in deer masks? No one's suspicious, but soon enough there'll be lots of happy people wearing deer masks for deer fest. Bro, the mocap is so good in this. I get good to know. So Rose, help me out. How do you think we know each other? We all know each other around here. It's been a while, but I never forget a face. Or a coffee order. Guess I just have one of those faces. Probably. Damn. Keep it down, Ed. You know how touchy these rural types can be. Deer, bro. So many deer. Rest easy, buddy. Do we get like an achievement or something for for petting all the deers? The dream work, teamwork, dream work. Yep. Rose is time. Is that lady gonna pop up on us over here again for the bathroom? I need a tool to get this open. Can't. All right. Bathroom. All right. Nothing weird here. Employees only. All right. I love the free roaming now. All set. My guys have Nightingale at the morgue. If you're ready to go, take a look. Let's go. Well, Casey, I got a lead. Looks like we're dealing with a cult. The cult of the tree. A murder cult. Fuck. Have you heard of this cult of the tree, Sheriff? Only the urban legend. If you're in the woods at night, the cult will get you. That sort of thing. We're not gonna find out you're the Grand Wizard or something, are we? I played some D&D &D back in the day. The Morning, wizard was Sheriff. always my... Looks like you have some guests. Ah, morning, Ted. Yeah, real important guest. Deer fest. Always draws a crowd, right? <laughs> Too true. More the merrier. Have a good one, Sheriff. Okay, interesting. Hey, what do you know about that waitress from the diner? <laughs> Rose? Yeah, she's a bit of a space case. She always has been. Why? What'd she do now? She kept saying that my daughter drowned. She even knew my name. It was all very weird. Rose has a talent for saying the weirdest thing possible. But best not to take it personally. I feel like they're still hiding some shit. I don't know. It does not... Doesn't feel right. Hey, boss. Corpse is downstairs ready to go. Yep. In the morgue. All prepped. I'd like to take a closer look as soon as possible. Lead the way, Sheriff. Go ahead, Sheriff. Oh, this is the Bright Falls Sheriff Station. Anything you need, just, uh... Let us know. We appreciate the support, Sheriff. All right. I'm loving this so far. So we share a morgue with the funeral home next door. It's a shoestring budget. I guess you guys don't have that problem, though. Our only coroner rotates between a few other towns, and he's away this week. But you can handle this, right? I'm qualified to perform examinations. Yes. I'm ready. I'm heavily, heavily invested. Something about morgues. They always cheer me up. I can't say I feel the same. He's <laughs> joking. Oh, there it is. I see him. I see our big boy. Oh, can you at least okay. cover him up? Let's take a look at our patient. I'll start with the external inspection before performing the internal examination. What was the cause of death? Aha. Uh -huh. They did leave something inside his chest. 
The body shows signs of being submerged in water post mortem. Yep. It doesn't add up. Defensive wounds. You put up a fight. This looks like text. A tattoo? Nightingale didn't strike me as a tattoo guy. There's writing on here. On the heart? Can't make it out. Time to see what Nightingale's body can tell us. I, I, I swear to God, this is so awesome. All right, anything to learn from the body. All right, so there's writing on his heart. Illegible words on heart. Writing on Makes his sense. smudged text. Text is smudged. Looks inverted. Heart can't have been marred before removal. Cause of death. Bruises. He got beat up. Tied up. Oh yeah, he was in water for a while, and then of course the cause of death was this. There's definitely something in his chest. Did the killers leave it there on purpose, bro? Watch it be another manuscript. And victims over here. <clears throat> oh, yeah. We're dealing with an organized group of killers, not a lone suit. The cult of the tree is behind these murders. This case just became much more complicated. I'll need to start a new file. But it's my first cult case. Exciting. Pretty exciting, I ain't gonna lie. All right. Cult of the Tree. Here we go. Set it up. I need to know more about the Cult of the Tree if I'm going to shut them down. Yep. Hold up. Wait, we do have some stuff on him. Yeah. For later. Cult goal. What's over here? Who's involved? Okay, I think, I think it's a top one up here. Yep. Cult symbol. The mask. Cult psychology. More of the symbol stuff right there. And then we have this right here. All right. Oh, here we go. Oh, come on. Did they not have like a blurred version of this? It's another manuscript. I knew I knew it was gonna be another manuscript. I knew it. It's the same type of page we found at Cauldron Lake. Nightingale haunted saga. Didn't see her. The taken could not see into bright light. Light hurt them made them vulnerable nightingale had no heart but here he was killing someone's created a fucked up fantasy about us hey hold on we found these kinds of pages i didn't think they were relevant to this case i have them right here
that sea into bright light. My gun's out in the hall. Gotta get it back. Oh, bro. Go. What the? What is going? <laughs> what is going on, man? End of chapter?